All right, leg day. We start off with high reps, 25 reps, going kind of light, swarming our legs up. This leg workout, we're basically doing a lot of quads and a lot of eh, decent amount of hamstrings. 27 sets in total. We do high reps. We don't, we're not doing like six to eight reps. 10 reps is like on the low end. So typically 10 to 20 reps, but we're getting a lot of blood flow to the legs. And then as you come up and keep coming, you just gotta raise that weight, keep pushing yourself, doing the max weight to failure. That's a big part of it, pushing yourself. So we'll start out with leg extensions. We'll do three sets, 25 each, and then we'll go to squats. Get for my win, I need my hands. This life is real, and they pretend. Game on the bench, I get it in. Leg day, most important day. Everybody skips it. We're doing that shit twice a week. I used to train every body part once a week. The growth was decent. You train your body parts twice a week, it changes your whole game for sure. Now we're doing legs twice a week. So we do this exact workout twice a week on Wednesday and on Saturday. We're training about six days a week right now. Seven days, like an active rest day. We still do cardio, still stretch. Still go to the gym to keep the habit strong. As long as you get in there and keep elevating your game and get on someone's program or get a coach, there's no way you're not gonna go up. The people that aren't taking it serious are the ones trying to do it themselves, maybe just kind of fumbling through a workout. You're really just wasting your own time. Once you get on a program, once you start training with somebody, everything's gonna go up and quick too. I've only been taking this series about three or four months now. And uh, I'm down about 15 pounds, getting a lot, lot stronger. I've literally doubled my weights in a lot of the exercises that I do. I'm dealing with a hernia right now. I gotta get surgery next week. So I still go light on squats, but uh, everything else has been crazy. So I'm gonna get the surgery, bounce back real quick, and keep it popping. But all the way up until surgery day, I'm gonna be training every single day. And then as quick as they give me to go ahead and start training again, I'll start training again right after I, I heal up from surgery. And I'll just go light, lightweight, high reps. You want to keep your rep volume high. If you think that you lose size by doing high reps, low weight, but you actually increase your size. So it works. You just got to get that pump going. You just got to stay consistent and go to failure. It's a big part of it. But you should be able to figure out what weight you need to hit so that you can do 20 reps to failure and keep going from there. You know, you'll, every week you'll probably go up in weight if you're staying consistent. And you just got to keep elevating and pushing yourself. So that's what it is. Alright, we did 20, 15, 
now we're gonna do tame. People might ask me, they'd be like, yo, what you training for? It's like, man, I'm training for the this movie hero coming up. It's called My Life. And that's what we're training for, man. We're training for our life. We wanna make that shit a movie the entire time you're living. And if you're not, you're wasting time, man. You should've did it, you're gonna have regret. Get off your ass. Go watching this video right now even. Run to the gym. Don't even drive there, run to the gym. Go do something, go on a run. Make sure you're living your life to the fullest. You get this training in, because like I say, once you get this work in, in the morning, the rest of your day is all downhill from there. Somebody can come in and be like, yo, your car's on fire. You're gonna walk out there calm, cool, and collected. Tired as a motherfucker. Cause you already hit that gym and you ain't got the energy to be tripping out. You stay cool in the chaos. That's what it's all about. We're going for this last 10. We're going back to leg extensions. All right, so we're moving on to hamstrings. We, uh, a couple of the machines are taken, so we're just gonna bounce back to more leg extensions. We did the step ups. We'll finish out with uh, seven sets of leg extensions. We're only gonna do 15 reps each on that, but 30 second rest. So you don't want to give yourself too much time. I think this, I think this kid actually just left over here. and check that out but uh you got a smoothie game you got to step it up and i ain't really i'm not really rocking my body energy club either their shit's all right you know but 
I'm still on the hunt for the best smoothie out. You know, I think that's what we're gonna be doing, smoothie reviews. All right. I, bro, I've been drinking smoothies since, really my whole life, my whole life. I'm a smoothie kid. I'm a smoothie I'm kid. I'm a smoothie <laughs> kid, bro. Like, I like a smoothie, man. I like, you know, make the, put some fruits in there, some peanut butter, some raw oats, some honey. Oh man, I'm out to make a signature smoothie and get behind the counter and end up showing these people how to make a smoothie. Open I got a Vitamix. Shop. I got a Vitamix at the office. You know, we ain't playing about the smoothie game, man. You got to have the right ice. There's a lot of layers to this game. And, you know, you're taking that workout serious. You're going to take that smoothie serious. So you know what it is. Come on, man. John Reed, part two. We did leg day now. Brought you guys along. I forget what we did the other day. What did we do back? I think we did back and buys. We've done back a few times on here. So we did legs, wanted to do legs today. Next time we'll hit you guys with like a chest, um, chest, shoulders, um, shoulder, yeah, chest, shoulders, and tries with abs. We skipped abs today because we got to, I'm going to get a haircut right now and we got to record a podcast episode later. We got to get to it. So we'll do abs at the office. Check back in for that. You already know what it is, at Powered by Pack. Make sure you like the video, comment, run it up. Let us, let me know, man. Where the fuck, where's everybody getting the good smoothies at? We're trying, we're on the hunt. I'm about to start doing some smoothie reviews. So uh, make sure you're following the page. And if this is a clip right now, make sure you go to the YouTube page and follow that and smash on the post notifications. Let's get it. See now he's sweating the swag. At first he was trying to be like, what is it? I don't, know, what, I don't know what this is, but the shoes is fire. Come on, man. Honestly though, you pull it off. I ain't pulling it off. I fuck with you. Thank you, bro. You already know. I was one of the first people to find Matt when he came down here. So you already know. I've been rocking with Matt a long ass time and I don't play by my barbers. We're definitely gonna get to work in. Chest day, next Just week. one time before you did. Nah, Monday. <laughs> We don't promote drugs, we don't promote violence. None of that shit. We're vice free, man. Can you believe that? I'm sober as hell, bro. Nothing. Not even water. I drink smoothies. I do drink smoothies. I got a smoothie problem. But uh you down? Monday? Let's do it. Alright, you guys see in here. We're gonna get mad in there in the don't, gym. Don't quote me on it though. <laughs> nah, we're getting you in there, baby. In the morning too, because I know you don't start What's till like eleven. Morning? Like nine? Eight thirty? 8.30. What time you gotta be ready to cut? You don't even cut on I Monday. start Mondays at 1 though. All right, so 10. All right, I can do it. All right, let's do it. Like wake up at 10 or be there at 10? Be there at 10. Oh, shit. I'll come pick your ass up. Let's do it, come on. All right, big dog. 